Hi folks, um, I've got a question. Now this weekend I played three games of 40k. Uh, unfortunately my camera decided not to record properly, my SD card thing was covered, so I didn't manage to film anything in the end. But, something came up in the game that made me really think about a tactic, and I'd like to just sort of get people's opinion on it, because I, I've come to a conclusion. I've seen other people come to the same conclusion in the past, and others who challenged it. And I'd like to sort of get some feedback and see what people think. Essentially, I've come to the conclusion that in Warhammer 40k, 7th edition, deep striking just doesn't work. <laughs> I've always been a huge fan of deep striking. It's one of the things that made me pick Blood Angels. The idea of a unit sort of falling from the sky with its jump packs, landing in the right place, ready to assault, ready to attack. Now, there's the fundamental problem. You can't assault when you land. At least not unless there's some kind of strange vague rule that I'm unaware of. But my little blood angels here, we need a little bit more paint because there's some new ones. Um, just land on the ground and become cannon fodder. If they don't get charged themselves by something else, which negates their furious charge and um, red thirst in bow formation, they get picked off by small arms fire, by every other fire, and the, the, the punch, the effect of sort of um, my, my, my death company and my um, sanguinary guard just goes out the window and my assault marines. And it seems that every time I play, without fail, I put them down, they land, they get shot, they die, or they get swamped by Tyranids or Eldar or whatever, whatever, whatever. And I've come to the conclusion that I just don't want to deep strike them anymore. I don't see any reason to do it, apart from maybe to try and claim an objective but if your tactic is to claim an objective from the start of the game, I'm not really sure that's, a, that's that much fun, to be honest. So really, and now I'm at the point where I'm thinking, these guys are going to come in, either take the jump packs off and jump out of a vehicle of some form and almost treat them like normal marines with the ability to charge, or put them in a drop pod, same, day, same game, or maybe um, just leave them where they are, hide them behind buildings and jump pack over the buildings ready to do an assault charge. So I'm really interested in other people's opinions. I just can't see any good use for deep striking. If you could, if you could deep strike and then charge, I think it would be fantastic. But really, these guys, they, they deep strike, I move them and I run them, and they scatter out a little bit and then get picked off. Or I shoot, maybe get a good round of fire off, and then get picked off and lose half the numbers. I played against Eldar at the weekend, and basically I had a D weapon on the on the centre of my um, unit. Lots of models hit, lots of models dead, and that's your lot. An unlucky roll, they're all gone, and it's I just can't see it. So I'm really interested. Um, I'll put this out there. Let can people give me an opinion on it? See what you think. Maybe tell me something that I'm not considering. What am I doing wrong? I really can't get my head around it. I've come from the playing fantasy for quite a long time. I'm in my 40k mode and everyone just laughs at me when I deep strike. So, come on, help me out. What am I doing wrong? Or am I doing it right? And I just don't know it. Thanks guys, cheers.